are immigrants, whether we were born here, that we have a destined future. And by using these types of programs and events to allow our young people to express themselves, to be creative, to be innovative, we're really giving the services that are necessary for our young people to be success stories. Oftentimes you hear so much about education, about our children, all of the bad things that are associated with defining the Bronx. But that's not who we are as Bronx residents, and that will never be the way that we should allow ourselves to be defined. I always say, instead of statistics, let's turn those numbers into success stories. And so I want to congratulate all the young people that participated in this essay writing contest this time, but certainly I do want to acknowledge you because that was an incredible story and I appreciate the chance to hear it. And when you think of that story, you think of so many people that come to this country to achieve the American, American dream. And so many people get discouraged, so many people don't think they have a right to be here, but we all have a right to be here. And we all have a right to fulfill our God-given destiny. So I am excited that this is actually the very first citation that I am awarding in my new role, so this is history for me, um, on behalf of my constituents in the 16th Council District. I just want to acknowledge and present a City Council citation. All right, Fatu Mata Fofana. All right, I want to present Fatu Mata Fofana the winner of the essay writing contest with the citation from my constituents on behalf of my district. We congratulate you. We wish you continued success in your educational path, and we know that the very best is yet to come from you. Congratulations.